Okay. So dad is going out to get some food. Is she up? No. All right, so mom is the only other one that needs to use the bathroom in here. So she can use, take a brisk shower, and then she can go ahead and have some of the leftovers as well, which is just the strawberry, or the scrambled eggs. Really? All right, dad's gonna have to repair this shower. And it looks like little Marcus is up. So many boys, these poor girls, uh, Julia and Tia, they are in for a rude awakening here. Ooh, their relationship is slipping. Did you see it? Look at their romance part. We're going to have to get them romantic again. Okay, Tia has to go to work in an hour. Are you kidding me? She's not even up out of bed. All right, Tia, get up. You need to grab some food. So let's get you to grab some scrambled eggs. So grab some scrambled eggs. Oh my god, that's a lot of spaghetti. Okay. I'm hungry. Alright. So Tia, just eat. Little man, why don't you just clean up your plate? Alright, so Alan's just upgraded the following... Um, just got the following upgrade parts, one common upgrade part, and one plumbing upgrade part. So that's exciting. Alright, so Alex is done in here. Go ahead and mop like mad, and then you might as well go ahead and repair this. Okay, you're not going to be able to mop that until you're done, actually. Go ahead and mop like mad when you're done repairing that. All right, and it looks like Dakota is up. He needs to go pee or poop or whatever. Um, he didn't fully sleep, but I think he'll be okay. All right, Tia, you probably are out to work. Just about. One common upgrade part, one plumbing upgrade part, and Jack's school starts in about an hour. Look how skinny she is again. She didn't gain barely anything at all. All right, you need to use the bathroom, so I'm going to let you use this. And he needs to go to school energized, right? Yeah. So he's energized. He'll be energized for another three hours. So we should have gotten it. We should get that, um, get this done. Once he actually goes to school. So that'll be exciting. All right, mom, I want you to go ahead and water all the plants. And I want you to weed all the plants. So that'll be good. Dad... All right, let's get you to scavenge uh -huh. through this. <laughs> and then I want you to grab some food for breakfast. And I think you're the one who made the, the eggs, so go ahead and grab a serving. Okay, let's see. Um, he obtained the falling parts, two common upgrade parts. And then, Dad, just go ahead and throw it away if you're done with it. Which I think you are. Okay, and you need some fun. So then you can channel surf. When you're done, you need fun. So you can channel surf. And when you're done, you don't really need anything. Um, you need to work on your mixology skill. So why don't you just make a drink? Why don't you make... Ooh, we got some more than he does. Why don't you make the ridge port? Sounds really good. All right, did we get that done? Yes, we did. Whoop, whoop. Finally, feeling better about that. So that puts him up a little bit better. That's good. Um, he is feeling good. He had a pretty good, pretty tasty food. And he had a brisk shower. So he is happy. All right, I think he's sad because he hasn't been communicating with family. Though I wanted to, but just never seems to work out for him. Poor guy. Alright. Mom needs to... Let's see. Nothing, really. She is good. She is in such a great mood. Alright. Threat report. Tia's got a big report on a new emerging threat due tomorrow at work, but she's swamped. 
She can either secretly ask for help from another researcher or work all night to get it done. What should she do? Let me know, guys. What you guys want to do? Um, how many upgrades can you have per object? I have no idea. I've just been upgrading and it just keeps giving like all of the upgrades to it. So I'm going to say you can probably upgrade as many times there are upgrades. You can probably upgrade that many times. So if there's like 10 different upgrades that you could do to a toilet, you can probably do all 10. But I really don't honestly know. I just know that you can upgrade a lot more objects in this too. Like I saw the refrigerator you can upgrade. Um, there's a lot more like per object too. So you can do a lot more per object. So I think that's probably a good thing in reality. Um, so hopefully that's going to work out for us. So just let me know if you guys want to ask for help or work all night. I'm going to look at how much battery I have. 44. So it's still going up. So that's good. Does anyone have an idea of what they want to do for the threat report? I'll give you guys one more minute. You always get it wrong. That's alright, just let me know what you think you should do. There's no right or wrong here. It's just a choice. Okay, you want to work all night. All right, let's see what happens. All right, so it says, As the sun comes up, Tia finally finishes the big report, but then she crashes under her desk and misses the presentation meeting. The work is done, but missing the meeting doesn't look good on her record. Performance loss of small. So it's not that bad. Um, so I think what I'm going to do, I'm going to just pause right here for a second. I'm going to save. Um... My dinner is done and on my plate right in front of me. So I'm going to quickly just mute my mic. I'm going to eat and I'm not going to cut off the live stream. So you guys can still like join in and chat. I can chat with you on the chat itself because I can type on my tablet. But for right now, I'm just going to be quiet because I'm going to be eating. Um, and when I am done eating, then I will be right back. But it's going to be, you know, a couple of minutes. I got to eat spaghetti. So it's not like going to be, you know, five minute meal. Um, but I will be right back when I'm done, so be right back.
Okay. So, I am back. <sighs> um. Alright, let's pick off where we were. Um. She is just watering the plants. Alex is watching TV. Um, Dakota is putting his dirty plate on the bar, which is inappropriate. I'm going to let him watch some TV when he is ready. Tia and Jack were at out, and Xander and Marcus were in their bassinets. That is their whole life. <clears throat> so that is what's happening. Okay. I like how they just sit right down. <clears throat> In the other one, they would just like bend over and do it. This is more appropriate, I think. Alright. Your son is not happy, so time to do daddy duties. Alright, change your diaper, bottle feed, bounce. At. Go ahead and Lubetra. cuddle. Make a silly <gasps> face. Rock him and talk to him. Alright. And when she's done in the garden, she is going to make the ridge port. But then I want her to actually work out. So let's see. I'm going to have her energize jog like mm, five times. Three, four. All right, there's five. I don't think she works today. She may. I don't know. Yeah, in five hours. So, wow, she's really bad at making drinks. Alex, let's get you off of that TV now and get you to get the mail. That would be great. You also want to dance to stereo music, which would be cool. And no, I did not finish eating. I only ate about half, and then I was like, I'm full. So I stopped. I did not use spaghetti that quickly. <laughs> um, I'm back. Me too. <laughs> Alright. Let's see. Um... Okay, you want to work out on a weight machine for four hours. Oh, shoot. We were supposed to go do that yesterday. Ah, I forgot. No. Um, okay, and he needs to work out. So let's just go let him box with the, the punching bag. So that'll be good. Um, Okay, so look at Dakota, like, coming to life over here as a father. It's so freaking cute. Oh, Zelgala. Okay, so he needs to cook an excellent grilled cheese. Okay, um, are you hungry? No. Is she hungry? A little bit. He is more hungry than anyone, so let's just have you cook up the excellent grilled cheese. Um, cook grilled cheese. We want a single serving, please. Alright, so Sir Marcus is much, much happier now that he is taken care of. He is like, this is the life, the life, the life, the life. This is the life. Okay, I don't know if he's really singing that, but that was my own made-up song, if you couldn't tell. <clears throat> um... Okay. Punch that punching bag. Alright, and I think she is... Oh, she just finished her drink. <clears throat> now she is going to go on her jogs for the day. And get her workout on. Okay, there we go. She changed into her outfit. She is on her jog. She is happy with life. Nothing could go better then jogging around the park. Okay, I don't know about that, but 
We're going to pretend. All right, Dakota, did you make excellent one? You did. Oh, my goodness. Gracious. All right. Oh, next baby is not happy. All right. Well, we're just going to have, he's just going to have to deal for five seconds. Secantos. All right, so Channel Surf and Alex, since your wife is out jogging and you're doing nothing, you're going to come in bottle feed, um, go ahead and bounce. He has a really good relationship with him. Kuat, go ahead and cuddle. Go ahead and make a silly face. Go ahead and rock him, and then you can talk to him. And then everything should be good. I'm going to check on Julia, who's still out here just working it out. I work out every day. <laughs> I wonder if this actually like will make her lose weight because I don't really see a difference happening. But I know she definitely has gained just a little bit in like the midsection of her body since she's had two kids and that's normal and to be expected really. Oh, I'm like, how is she, like, going through all these interactions so quickly? But it's him. No one do I. Don't mind the crazy lady over here. <clears throat> who's literally lost her bananas. How is the stream going? The stream is going well on my end. You guys just seem to be a little bit quiet. And there isn't a lot of you, which this was the whole point was to get a lot of you to come for a little while at least. And interact with me and... There's some of you who have been very interactive. Then there's some who have been a little bit more on the shy side. But I'm sure that will change. And I've noticed that I've gotten a few followers, new followers on Twitter and stuff. So I'm thinking that this live stream is going pretty well. How is your stream going? I don't even know if you're doing a stream and just pretending. All right. Um. Okay. So he is such a freaking good dad. He is amazing at this. And he has a really good relationship with him, too. So I'm really actually happy with him, with how well he's doing with these kids. Though he is family-oriented, so it kind of makes sense for him to be, like, all about the babies. Okay, my cats have lost their minds again. Ooh, work for Alex will start in about an hour, and so will it for Julia. I really don't like that everyone is going to be out of the house, especially on one side of the family. Like I, like I said, I try to make sure that, you know, the parents take care of the kids. And I feel like sometimes when they aren't around to be able to do that, I kind of feel like, shoot, I like, you know, m made like, not like a bad parent, but I just feel like sometimes they should be here more for their kids. And sometimes it's just not able to be done. But anyways, that is my own personal thought. I don't know about you guys. I don't know how she's flirty and like running around outside. I don't even know. She's having a good workout. She's feeling happy. She's got the romantic decor. I'm going to have to close my door because that game down there is too loud. Okay. Sorry about that, guys. Door is closed, so you shouldn't really hear it anymore. Ooh, he is tired. Does he not work? today yes he does in two hours okay you need to stop watching this and you need to go take a nap because you are exhausted and I don't know why but you are so let's get you to take a nap quickly I think Tia gets home at three. Oh, her phone is going off Tamara Grove would like to come over to hang out actually we're leaving so there's no point in coming over She's going to be leaving to go to work. And Dakota starts in about an hour. All right. Oh, look at Alex. He is so, like, dressed up. Oh, my goodness. Strut it, little man. Look at him. All dressed up in his, like, work uniform. He is so buff. It's crazy. It's crazy. And he works out all the time. So it's not like he's fat. He's just, he's very muscular. All right. And then we got Julia over here who's headed to work and she is still in the same uniform I think her stomach has went down actually a little bit it's not so like you know 
puffed out in the front. So I think she did lose a little bit of weight with all the jogging we've made her do. I still say she's gained quite a little bit of weight. Um, okay, so Dakota is going to work soonish. Alright, and Tia is now home with 152 simoleons. All right, so let's see. It says, it's the weekend. Jack wraps up this week with a C in school. Is that really satisfactory? Oh, shush it. He's working hard. He went to work to school and got something done today, so be quiet. Leave the poor kid alone. All right, I am going to let her go ahead, and she is going to channel surf. Poor Jack. The school's picking on him. I thought he was doing really well. Like, look at his school performance. He's all the way up in the dark green. He does need to get his homework done, and he needs to get two skills slow level four, but he attended school while energized today, so that got that done. So they just need to shush it over there. He's doing well. Let's leave the poor kid alone. Okay, so we'll get these two skills up this weekend. Which I think, from the skills that I know that he has, I think we're going to work on creativity, possibly, and mental. Unless you guys want to do motor and social. I mean, we could do motor and mental, maybe. Um, motor is if he plays on, like, the monkey bars or the jungle gyms. This one is, uh, this creativity skill can be developed on the activity table and easel. Increasing the skill will unlock new activity table drawings dollhouse interactions and socials and then the mental is done on like the science table and the chessboard oh we should get the science table for him he's got that little science thing um so he could he could up do he could do his creativity it's no big deal but we just get two skills to level four and creativity creativity is really close so i want to at least do that one but <laughs> it doesn't really matter to me between mental or motor because they're pretty close so i mean not really gonna matter oh and he needs to go to work doesn't he yes go to work i am i apologize what time were you supposed to be at work uh three i let you like stay home for an extra hour that is horrible of me whoops and you lose progress pretty quickly too <coughs> which really stinks Ooh. she's really pretty isabel colgate what is she named after toothpaste? Colgate toothpaste. Wahaha. Alright, so Tia, you need sleep now. Yeah, you can stop watching TV now. And I'm going to jump over to your son because he's the closest to your bed. You can sleep, and then when you get up, I'm going to let you go ahead and use and... And you can go ahead and take a brisk shower. You, little man, need to eat when you're done. So we're going to get you to eat. And I might take him out to the park today. You guys want to take him out to the park? Have a quick meal. No, we want to have a leftover meal of... Let's see what's in here. We've got uh, scrambled eggs. We've got some spaghetti. Which, what goes bad first? This is seven days. Six days for the grilled cheese. Alright, so let's grab the grilled cheese. Let's grab a serving of that. Other than that, I think he is pretty okay. And we could take him out to the park and let Tia stay here with the kids and just let her focus on it uh, for a little while. Yay, Merlin's child's back. Welcome back. Do you guys want to take um, Jack to the park and just let him play on like the monkey bars and stuff? I would buy it for him here, but I kind of feel like what's the point of the park if you don't go there to use something? So, I think we should probably take him out to the park and let him just play on the monkey bars. And since it's still early, he should be able to travel by himself. I do believe, anyways. I didn't see where it said you couldn't, so... I don't know. It'd be kind of dumb if he can't go to the park by himself. So, we'll see. If he cleans all that up and everything, then I'll let him head on over. And he can take care of bladder there. And when his energy gets really down, then we'll just bring him home. It's not that big of a deal. Everyone gets home pretty late, I think, anyways. He gets home at 10. She gets home at 10. And he gets home, I think, at 11. Yeah. So as long as they're home by, like, 10 o'clock, I don't see, like, a big deal in it of taking him out to the park. So go ahead and clean up your plate really quickly, and then we'll take you out. 
and we'll let Tia stay here with the two babies and she can just take care of them. And then when we get back, um, hopefully mom or dad is home and then we'll just ha when I come back, I'll just make sure both babies get fed and stuff. So we don't have the issue of, oh my goodness, like this one is, you know, upset. So I know the one's crying, but she'll take care of it. So travel, we're going to travel with just you. And Tia can take care of her own kid, I'm sure. So I'm not going to deal with it. She can deal with it. She's going to go to the bathroom instead. <laughs> She's like, I got to pee and I can't take care of you right now, kid. Though I would love to. All right. So let's take him over here to the pirate ship one. Because I know he got he unlocked something from this. So that'll be exciting. Um, have you ever added custom clothes? Um, to Sims 3 I have, but not to The Sims 4. Uh, is there some good custom clothes? I just, I kind of wanted to spend some time with the actual, like, base game itself and not any mo add any mods to it. For the fact that I felt like, you know, the game was made like this, and this is how I should probably play it for a while. So I probably won't add mods or anything to the game. Just kind of, you know, unless it gets really boring, and then I will. But, at the point this point in time it's okay so let's go ahead and play on this little um playground he's lost his mind because he's too excited and then he can play on these with the kids as well so maybe he could <clears throat> meet some kids that would be kind of cool what's better slide the plank Alright, so I think this is when he slides down. Woo! Aww, this is so cute. Alright, and you can play pirate. And this is building up his skills, so we definitely need to get him to do this a little bit more. Especially now that he's got his weekend, he's got his homework done. He can be coming over here like every day. There's no reason he shouldn't be able to come over here and play on the playground with the other kids. I mean, he's a kid. If a parent doesn't let you play Bo in the playground, Bado. then they've got some issues. <laughs> Why are you guys talking to my kid while he's playing? They're just like all walking over like, hey, we gotta talk to you right now. So, Zoe and... The grid are. Why are you like screaming, child? How did he get up there? I want him to be up there. Okay, I really don't want to talk with you guys. I just want him to play. So, you guys go find someone else, some other little kid to talk to. For each other. That's fine, too. Oh, look at these kids at the same time going across. How freaking cool is that? I wish we could find the goth kid and become really good friends with him. I think that'd be really cute. Alright. I want to be up here. It must be because they're both playing pirate and they both can't play the same thing. So, that's fine. That's fine. Once he gets his skill, I'm going to go ahead and let him use the bathroom because he really needs to go. Are their voices overpowering me talking? Because I feel like I'm screaming at you guys and I do apologize. Um, <clears throat> playing pirate. Sailing the seven seas. Yarg. Beware of salty sea monsters. <laughs> He's up to level two. Jack's motor skill is improving nicely. All right, Jack, let's go ahead and let you use the bathroom, friend, because you really need to go. Can you do anything different now? Mm, doesn't really look like it. So I guess when you're done, come back and play on the little monkey bars. That's, that'd be cute. Okay, so Jack is a really skinny kid, even. Um, <clears throat> I was thinking he was going to be a little bit on the chunkier side, because his mom has a little bit of chub to her, which is good. You want a little bit of meat on those bones. I, personally, am not really skinny, either. Um, 
and I have nothing against girls who, you know, are a little bit heavier. But most of the time when you have a woman who is <clears throat> a little bit heavier set, they normally, their kids become a little bit heavier set when they're like children's age. Um, not because they're fat, just because that's how kids are and that's how they're built most of the time. But he is like scrawny, mini scrawny little kid. He definitely took after his father, I think, in those genes. So you, there again, you can see the difference between The Sims 3 and The Sims 4 because it would have... The kids would have been built exactly like the parents, but this one, he's not, like, extremely skinny, but he's not, like, extremely, like, hefty either, so it's cute. I like it. I really like the genetics in The Sims 4. Can't wait to see him as a teenager. I'm really excited for that. I think that'll be fun. All right, so we've got about another hour, and then we need to be home for mom and dad <clears throat> to take care of the babies and stuff. Um... Ooh, that was a nice little move there. Ooh, he got scared. Oh, poor guy. He went, he skipped, he missed that one bar and he got so scared. He was like, oh my god. <laughs> He's really good at this, though. It's kind of fun to watch, too. Go, Jack, go. You can do it. Yay. Ooh, look at him go, guys. He's going two at a time now. Holy smokers. I had no idea they could go that many at a time. I thought they always had to hit each one. That's so cool. Is he getting, like, motor skill from this? Oh, yeah, he is. Okay, good. I love how it just stays there. Ooh, he almost fell. Oh. He got so scared again. He was like, oh, God. I almost broke my neck. <laughs> he laughed at the same time I did. Too funny. Yeah, but he's so freaking cute. And what is he at for skill-wise on this? Um, motor is two. So he's almost the same as mental. I mean, we're going to work on more than just one, two skills, but I'm just saying, which ones do you guys really want to work on? I'd like to see how motor can actually help them. Um, and creativity sounds pretty cool. I mean, we worked on motor over here on the pirate ship too. So we're working on it a little bit more here and it's really time that we got to go home. So let's go ahead and send him home. Dad made 568 simoleons today, and Mom made 344 simoleons today. So that's exciting. All right, I am going to send Little Man home because I think he's had a pretty good day here at the park, but he is getting pretty tired, and it's getting pretty late, so let's not keep him out too late. I mean, he is a child still. He should be home by probably 10. We kind of are a little late, but... Mom and Dad, I'm sure will understand that he was having a ton of fun on the monkey doll, monkey bars. Um, all right, so I thought that was a little bit fun to take him, just him out, spend a little bit of time with just Jack, see like what he likes to do. He obviously loves those things. Um, he was really getting daring there for a minute with the two bars. I would never do that. I would be too scared. Though I think I'm old enough now where I could just reach my arms up and <laughs> walk across, but eh, it's still the thought that counts. There's like those people that used to hang upside down on them at my school when I was younger, and I used to get so scared because I'm scared of heights. So they would like dare me to do it, and I'd be like, no, I can't. I'd be like so upset because I literally couldn't because I was so scared. I'm so scared of heights. But I love roller coasters. If you can figure that one out, then let me know. Um, I guess roller coasters are a little bit different, too, because you can't really see the ground when you're on them. Yeah, you know they're up there in the air, but you can't see how far because it's moving so fast. All right, so I'm going to let him go to bed because he came home and he's exhausted. Is Dad eating? Yeah, he's eating some grilled cheese, so he's good. He took care of himself, which is good. Um, looks like Dakota's still at work, so that's fine. All right, Tia needs to get up because her baby. What are you doing? <laughs> she's just like, I will take this baby as my own. She's cuddling him, but it's not even her baby. So let's put the baby down and let's take care of your baby because you need to feed your baby. Anyways, um, bounce, kuat, cuddle. Uh, make a silly face. 
let's rock him and talk to him. And then I am going to get you to take care of your baby. Because it is your baby. And if you're here to take care of it, then take care of it yourself. You don't need to change the diaper. Okay, go ahead and bounce him. Aww. And coo at him. And get cuddle him. him. Make a silly face. Rock him and then talk to him. Okay, and then mom, when you're done, you need fun. So I am gonna let you actually, I'm gonna let you and your husband talk a little bit. You're gonna be a little bit romantic, and why don't you guys go ahead and woohoo? Don't try for baby, just woohoo. Okay, and when you're done, you can go back to sleep. Because I know you're still tired, and I understand, but your kid comes first. They look identical, don't they? I hate that. But you can tell they have a little bit of a skin difference, I think. Um, I think Xander's a little bit tanner than Marcus is. Marcus is very, very pale, I guess you could say. Alright, Dad, I'm going to have you just go here. Alright, so to... Dakota came home with 208 simoleons. He wants to kiss Julia. Left her. Not Dakota. Alex does. Oh boy. Go ahead and sleep. You're not trying for another baby. Um, not right now, anyways. Alright. Alex. I think Alex and Julia might be done with kids, but I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. We will see. We will see. Okay. Julia. We're waiting on you to woohoo, friend. We are waiting on you to woohoo. <laughs> I love the little planet over the baby's crib. I think it's cute. <laughs> and Alex is happy. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so it did definitely boost up their relationship pretty quickly, which is good, which is what I was looking for. I think tomorrow, if they have some time, I might take them to the gym together. Uh, he has 15 hours, or she has 15 hours, and he has three days. What is wrong with Marcus now? All right, Dad, your turn. Change the dirty diaper. Mounts. Kuat. Cuddle. Make a silly face. Rock him and talk to him. Mama. And Tia, you can go to sleep. Actually, why don't you go to the bathroom? Oh, me. Why don't you go use thy toilet and then you can sleep? She's so freaking tiny, man. Right. You, on the other hand, are good. You guys are both good. How did that bump up your relationship with her? Much better. I am much happier with that status for you, too. So that's good. All right, and you, I'm going to look and make sure that you are the same way because they can have two different relationships with their kids. She really needs to work on her relationship with Jack's, Jack a little bit, and her relationship with Xander is really good. Tia's okay, but not great. I mean, Xander and uh, Jack are about the same now, so they're kind of slipping, and I want them to go the opposite direction. Not slipping, but getting better. All right, and you, on the other hand, how are you and your wife's relationship going? Oh, boy, I'm scared to look. Um, not the greatest. You guys are not doing that hot with relationship-wise. You are doing pretty good with your son, though, so that's good. All right, so they're good friends now. That makes me even happier to know that they're really bonding. You just get caught up in so much stuff. Like, so much can be going on at the same time, and you can be like... Yeah, that's that's perfect, but really, you know, you may want something else to happen. But we'll see. Okay, the baby is not happy again. All right, <clears throat> I am gonna pause because I don't even know what's going on. All right, who needs the relationship boost with him? You are pretty good with him. What about you? You need it. So I'm going to let you take care of him this time. You're going to change his dirty diaper, which I thought we just did, but maybe not. You can breastfeed him. Go ahead and bounce him. 
go ahead and coo at him. You can cuddle him. I mean, the other baby's not even crying. Make a silly face. All right, and then you, on the other hand, I'm going to let you just go right back to sleep. Okay, do you need to pee or something? Yeah. Go use the bathroom. And then I'm going to let you sleep because you need to finish sleeping. Come on, take care of him and it wouldn't be a problem. All right. I'm going to let you sleep because you need to finish sleeping. Otherwise, you guys are pretty good. Um, you, on the other hand, you need to make a silly face. Then let's see. Go ahead and rock him and talk to him. And then Aww. you can sleep. You know what bugs me? They can be breastfeeding their child in their room. And obviously, when you're breastfeeding, you know, you're exposed. And they don't get mad when someone walks in on them or is in the room with them. Like, they don't shoo them away. But, like, if they were to go to the bathroom they get up all upset. I really don't get it. You would think that they would get upset if someone walked in on them breastfeeding as well, but I guess not. I guess it's a total different kind of exposed. I don't know. Not for my eyes, but okay. That's fine. Oh, she's like kissing him and stuff. It's so cute. Man, all of you guys need to pee. Just don't break the toilet. That's all I ask. Okay, I'm probably not going to have you go back to sleep. I'm probably just going to let you stay up because you're already up. Go ahead and take your brisk shower. Oh, and you need to take care of your son. Look at that. Actually, pause for a second. Who needs the better, who needs the relationship with him more? Wow, you are not up there as high as I thought you were. And she's up higher than you. So she's going to sleep while you take care of your son. So good luck with that one. Bottle feed. Bounce. Kuat, um, I can do two more. Cuddle and make a silly face. Little man's up and I'm happy because he had a great night last night. He is like, I'm ready to go back. Let's go back. All right, um, let's go ahead and grab some uh, scrambled eggs for you for breakfast. I think that would be a, a good one for you. All right. Okay. Alright, so Marcus and Tia are good friends now, too. So that's exciting. Alright, so you have got your food. When you're done, please clean up your plate. I think the reason they don't clean it up when they're up here is because they have to jump down and it's a different interaction than if they were just to stand up. So... I mean, I guess it's taking up, like, an interaction space that really, it shouldn't, but it does. Okay, well, that's fine. Okay. It looks like Marcus is very happy with and content with life right now. Who's going to be getting up first, you or her? He is. Okay, so I am going to let him use the bathroom. And I'm going to let him take a brisk shower. And then I am going to let him eat some scrambled eggs. So grab a serving. Uh, when you are done taking care of your son, which shouldn't be, you know, too long, you're making a silly face with him. You can go ahead and rock him. And you can go ahead and talk with him. And that'll be good. Why is he all upset with you? I don't get it. Sometimes they cry at that, sometimes they don't. I don't get it. Alright, so go ahead and let's clean this up. Did that say play game? Yeah, it did. Yeah, see, they just jump right up out of the chair. Where if they were from there, they have to jump down and then they could grab the plate. So it's like a total different interaction, which is so weird. Um, and you already did your homework, so that's good. I'm going to get you to take care of your bathroom needs. Um, I'm actually going to let you use mom and dad's because I don't know when Dakota's getting up and I already have him set up to use that bathroom. So, let me just get you in here to take care of your needs. I don't think I set mom up yet, so, and she doesn't really need to. So, I'm going to just set her up to eat some scrambled eggs, which is only two left. So, somebody's going to have to cook. Looks like Tia is going to have to cook. Poor Tia. 
She always gets thrown under the bus. All right. And then when mom is done, she can go ahead and shower. She can take her brisk shower. And that'll be good. And we're going to take dad out. And mom, if she's awake. If she's not, then we're not taking her. We'll just leave her behind. But, yeah, we're going to take him out to the gym. Okay, can you have breakfast? Can you have some... Eat some scrambled eggs. Grab a serving of this. Uh oh, they're gonna they're gonna f inf uh, conflict with each other now. <laughs> See, watch, he'll just exit out. So annoying. Don't do that. Open. All right. So place this in the world, and then you can grab a serving. I'm gonna let you just clean up the mess, mop like mad, and let's see, Dad. You can go ahead and grab a serving. All right, and then Dakota, you can't eat that because there is none, so I'm going to let you serve breakfast, serve up some eggs and toast. Why not? We haven't done that in a while. So it looks like everyone is getting ready to go. I'm going to get you to clean this up because you're a good boy and you help out, which is great. All right. There's no mail, so we're good to go. When you're done, go ahead and go here. Mom, when you're done, go ahead and go here. And then Dad, when you're done, go ahead and go here. Perfect. Actually, Dad, you need to eat first. Eat your friggin' food. Eat your scrambled eggs. And then you can clean them up. Okay, and then he needs to cook. Alright, and when she gets up, she is going to use... Use... Take a brisk shower, and then she can grab some food from whatever he puts out. Clean this up. Okay, so it looks like mom's done. So when he is done, we're going to travel with, and then we're going to travel with Julia and Jack. We're going to travel both of them. And we're probably going to go to the gym first, and then after that, when one of them has to leave to go to work, I'll just send them home. And then... We can take it's Jack to the park to play on the monkey bars and stuff some more. So that'll be fun. So it's just like a family evening out. But um, so let's take them to the gym. Do you guys want to go to the gym here in Willow Creek? Or do you guys want to go to the gym in Oasis Springs? Oh, why is this not charging? Gah. They had it up to like 47 and now it's down to 31. So annoying. Um. Okay, um. Alright, I'm going to see if you guys have any options. Uh, Oasis Springs, and you have a question. Okay, so go ahead. I am here, ready to answer. Um, Alright, so you guys want to go to Oasis Springs? Do you want to go to this gym here? Which, I don't even think I've been to this gym, to be honest with you. So, I think this is my first. Um, so, if you guys haven't seen it either, well, here you go. You're going to see it in just a second. Um... Okay, so here we are. Well, it's still loading, but I heard the music, so I know it's coming. There we go. Oh, yeah, I've been here. I've been here. Now I remember it when I seen it. Okay, so I'm going to let Dad work out. And he needs... His thing was what? 
Um, he needs to work out on a weight machine for four hours. He goes to work in three days, so I'm not really worried. So I'm going to let him work out here. Um, it says work out on a machine, so I'm going to say energized workout on this. Um, and then I am going to let mom, which I know she doesn't really need to work out, but I want her to, just to get in shape for her kids. She can do an energized workout on the treadmill. And then little man, I don't even know. Can you even do anything on these? No. Um, shoot, I didn't think about this. Well, you could dance. I mean, that's fine. But I wish they put like monkey bars or something. There's got to be like a jungle gym. Ha ha. I found it, guys. Don't you worry now. All right, so I am going to let him go ahead and come play on the monkey bars while parents are at the gym. He should be able to travel over there without having to load a new screen. It's in the public space, so he should be able to do this without any problems, really. He should just be able to run over here, go play, and do what he wants while his parents work out. It's cool. So I like that about that. Will anything happen to my original family if I make a new one? Um, if you make a new save file, then no. If you make them in the same town, I suggest you turn off, like, aging for everyone else because they will age and they'll get older. But if you want to do it in a different save file, like a new game, then no. Nothing will happen to them. You'll, you'll just have more than one save. Like in The Sims 3, kind of. So, yeah, you can make multiple different save files. I think I have, like, five or six going already. I have this one. I have my Let's Play. I have two current households. Okay, so four. Alright, so Alex is up to fitness level five. He can now make potion shakes at the bar. He can also perform the no sweat run on the treadmill. Nice. So that's kind of cool. Oh my god, there's a clown. I am so friggin' scared right now. Do not come close to my sim. I will freak. Just get out of here. I hate clowns. I really do. They freak me out to the extreme. So I'm going to have to go over here. Just because I'm a little bit freaking out right now. Okay. So he's been working out for one hour. And she's over there working out. And having an unpleasant conversation with Cherish. This girl. Okay. Well, at least they're like having a conversation. Why are you stopping? Push the limits. You're gonna have to go like two more times or something. I don't know, like one or two more times. Okay. And he has two days till school. Dad has three days, but really it's only like two days and some hours if you think about it. Um. Oh, God, this scares me to death. Cherish is happy. And then she has three hours. All right, Jack can now ask for typing tips from other Sims. That was, he just reached the next motor skill um, level. So I'm going to see if he does any different tricks now that he's got this going. He can do push-ups. Oh, my goodness. He is really, like, booking it. He can still do the two by two, so that's pretty cool. Is there anything else he can do with this? Just this play. Alright, I am going to let mom head home because she's got two hours before she goes to work. So I am going to let her go home and the other two are going to stay here. She can go take care of little Xander because I'm sure Xander needs some attention before she heads to work. So she can go do that. Okay. He looks tired. Why don't you go play on this over here for a little bit? Mm, why don't you play pirate? Yeah, see, how does this kid get this? I want to play up here. Ooh, play pirate together. Oh, 
Oh, he's making a friend. Liam Salazar is going to be his friend. Cute. All right, Julia's got to start work in about an hour, but she's already at home, so I'm not too worried. And you have finished working out on the weight machine for four hours. So you could actually stop working out, and you could come work with your son. I don't know. Um... See, I know there's like the park, but what else can we do with like father and son? Like, what else can you do with them besides take them to the park? Obviously, um, is there anything else that you can do with them? And he's just sitting over here working out constantly, but he should be ready. He's ready for his next promotion as an a um level five of the astronaut career. So that's pretty cool. Um. Get two skills to level four. He is still working on that. He is at level three of motor and level three of creativity. So if we could get motor up to level four, we could actually head home and then we could get him to get his creativity skill up. Um, I hit create new game. Do I save when I am gone? When I'm done? My legacy lives in Willow Creek. I would click save as and make a new file name. All right, Dakota starts work in an hour, and so does Julia. So that leaves Tia at home to take care of the kids. So I think now that Dad is done working out, he can actually go home because he's fatigued anyway. So it's not like he can do much more here anyways. And then I'm going to let little Jack stay out until he gets his next skill in motor. He's getting social, though, too. He's getting that up because he's talking with the little kid. Are they any friends? Please tell me they're friends. No, they're acquaintances. It looks like they're friends. Can he play up here? I wanted to play up here. Play pirate. Let's see if I click up here if he'll actually come up here. This part. Is he going to go up there? Yay! <laughs> Oh my goodness, this is too freaking cute. Can you talk with this kid? What's this kid's name? I don't even know. Okay, seriously kid, you're moving too much. This is something Ingram. Uh, Maximus Ingram. Why don't you invite Maximus to play pirate with you? Yeah. Come play pirate, kid. We want some friends. Alright, Dakota's off to work. And so is Julia. Just didn't tell me that. Okay, so we aren't... We're friends with Liam now, but we're almost... We're getting to be friends with Maximus. Who else does he know? He knows Vaughn Colgate. And that's it? Yeah. No. Yeah, that's it. Okay. So we're making friends. That's good. Making friends in the neighborhood. Who are you going to call? <laughs> okay. So, here we go. He is just playing on this thing constantly. This is all he wants to do. I wish in a way you could just, like, click on your other people at, like, home and you could travel back and forth. But you actually can't. Like, I wish you could just, like, leave him here for a little while by himself and go see what dad is, like, doing at home. But you can't. Like, if I click on him. Yeah, well, let me go back to him. Um... What else can he do? Oh, look at this. Ten garden, switch control. Ooh, you can. Look, you can switch controls. Oh, my goodness. I just found out something so new. I love this game even more because I'm so excited now. 
Because I always felt like I was stuck with like one sim while the other one was like out in town. Like I was always stuck with that one sim out in town. But now that I know that I can actually switch back, I'm so excited because that means I have so many more things that I can do. Like he can be playing and playing with the kids there and having a good old time. And I won't have to worry about him. That is freaking cool. Oh my goodness. You guys are so excited, aren't you? <laughs> Probably not. You guys are like, uh, you're a freak. Alright, so two of them should be at work. Okay, so he is uncomfortable, but the only reason he's uncomfortable is because he's fatigued. It's not because he needs needs met, so that's good. Alright, um, someone was cooking and didn't finish, so I'm going to say it's probably Tia. So Tia, can you please come and resume your eggs and toast. Actually, I think it was Dakota, but he had to go to work, so it's a good thing he didn't burn the house down. Um, okay, so he's done with work, so he can just kind of work in whatever he wants to, and I'm kind of thinking that maybe we should go ahead and just let him craft some furniture, maybe, and do a dining chair. That was a dining table. I don't want a dining table. I want a dining chair. Okay, that's cute. Alright, and I want to tell him what to do. So let's see. He can bring, you can bring Garcia back here, care for self, socialize with, or switch control. So socialize with, no, just, just do what you're doing. You're doing good. You're building that skill, hopefully, so I'm hoping that's going to be what you're doing anyways. All right, so that's exciting that you can actually like switch controls. I didn't know you could do that. That's why I was always really upset. But now that I know that I can actually do that and I can leave someone behind, that's kind of cool. Okay, and it looks like our radio is broken, Bingo. which is really ridiculous. Ah! You want to kiss your wife? That's kind of normal. Uh -oh. Okay, what are, was this again? Eggs and toast? Yeah, I think so. And you still need to eat, so why don't you grab a serving of it? Grab a serving, and then you can put this away. There we go. Perfect. So do you guys know of any houses? Have you guys put any houses up so that we can move or switch houses at least, or no? If you guys have, tag it by GBCLV or GBaby Challenger, and I will definitely see it. Okay, so let's see. Okay. All right, and when you're done, you can go ahead and repair this. I wonder if it gets to a point where like you can't repair it anymore. I wonder if that happens. Uh, uh huh. Is he even like doing anything? I wish you could see what he was doing. Alright, so the dish is undercooked. An unhappy customer has sent back a dish that's undercooked and inedible. Dakota can handle this one of two ways. Either nuke it in the microwave or make the dish over from scratch. What do you guys want to do? Just let me know when you guys have caught up and let me know what you guys want to do. And while you guys do that, I'm going to grab a drink. Also, I'm looking for some other sims for the town. Either couples or singles or like single parents, anything you guys want to put out there. I'm looking to fill up the town because I feel like this part of the town is not being filled up. Um, and I just want to add a couple of the houses to it. Um, 
So if you guys want to do that, that'd be great. I'm not going to play as them, but they're going to be here. We could become friends with them. We could see them. Uh, we could visit them. You know, all that kind of fancy stuff. So if you guys want some of your households to be featured, then definitely give me those sims and I will put them in the town. Otherwise, uh, we're just going to keep living with the same old sims. Um, what about the mini mansion you made? Um, did you show it to me? Was it, were you the one that showed it, showed me a house? You want to make it over. Gimbara. We're making the dish takes too long and the customer leaves. Maybe next time Dakota should use the microwave. And he just finished his table or his chair. So I am going to jump in here and we are going to grab the chair out, which I kind of like the chair. I just wish you could recolor some of this stuff. Mm, place this in the inventory. Here we go. So this is what the chair looks like. It's kind of cute though. If you did the room in red, it would definitely look nice. Where do we get another coffee pot from? Oh, because they're in the same thing. We got a gold one or a brown one. So we could really choose between those two as well. Okay. That's fine. Can we change the color of it? Are we able to? Yeah, it will let us. I'm just going to put it in black and white. And I'm going to sell this other one because we don't really need two. So we're going to sell for 210. Um, we don't really need two of this either, I don't think. So I... Uh, yeah, we can get another one. So we can just delete that. Um, and I'm going to leave that chair in there just in case we need it. All right, so let's see. Dad is fixing the stereo. All right, let me go check out this mini mansion. I'm going to save really quickly. And I'm going to go check out this mini mansion that you made because I'm not really, really sure if I remember it correctly. I just don't remember if it was the one that we had to make, like, add on to. Because if that's it... Um, that's fine, but we'll have to do a lot of building right now, and um, I was seeing if anyone had made anything specifically for this family, but we'll go look. Alright, so let's see. Open the gallery. Um, nope, community. Uh, let's go by hashtag all. I think it was under GBCLV. Okay, so let's search that. Ooh, there's a couple of them. Yeah, see, this is the one that I made yesterday. I thought it was really cute. Raider Junkie made one. Um, this is zero bedroom. It's a two bedroom, one bath. So that's smaller than what we already have. Because we already got a, like a four bedroom almost. Alright, let me look by your name. It was... His angel. I can't remember what it was exactly. Stop. No, I didn't say do that. Come on, stop doing this. Okay, let's see. What was it? His angel... One, five, one, one. Did we see this one? Oh, well, I'm supposed to be going in origin IDs. That might be helping. Uh... This one? The Oaken, Oakensteed. Um. How much is this worth? Ninety-one thousand three hundred and fourteen. 
91,314. I gotta remember that because I gotta go in here and see how much we're worth. Yeah, we're not even close to 91,000. We need 60,000 more. And I don't really want to cheat for money, so. Unfortunately, that is a no. We can't afford it. Though I would love to. Because <laughs> it looks much bigger than what we've got. Um, let's just see. This is one, two, three... Uh, four, I'm going to say three bedrooms, one, two, three baths. That's what I'm going with. Three bedroom, three bath. Um, I don't know. I would like at least a four bedroom. Well, I guess all three of the boys could share. So really a three bedroom, three bath. Or even like a three bedroom, two bath would be fine. So let's see if we can find something. Um, we want lots. Most recent. Can we do advanced and like choose? Oh, we can. Snap. All right. We want like 20 to 40 price range, really. And this is a 30 by 20 lot. So we're really, we're really cutting down here. Um, let's see. Can we like choose? We want a residential lot type. Okay. So what's this one? This is a two bedroom, one bath. Not going to be big enough. I can tell you that much. Unfortunately, it's not going to be big enough for us. We need at least a three bedroom. The ultimate bachelor pad. Oh my goodness. One bedroom, one bath. No way that's going to work for us. And the mid-century mansion looks kind of nice. But it's only a one bedroom, one bath. Yeah, we're kind of screwed here, guys. What about like 10 to 20, though? Is there anything in this price range? Ooh, there is. Nice. Alright. So this is a two bedroom, one bath. So it's quite not not quite big enough. I wish you could see how much they how many bedrooms and baths there were. That's two bedroom. Uh one bedroom. This is one bedroom. Um one bedroom. Darn it. Uh zero bedrooms. Don't really know how that works. Um no description given. So much fun. Okay. I don't understand what this is. Okay. It's really dark. I can't really see it. What about 0 to 10,000? No results. Okay. So we're not doing so hot here, guys. Um, what happens if we went 40 to 80,000? Would we find some that we can actually afford so we could, like, strive for that? That's a one bedroom, one bath. Too small. This is by Curtis Parody. It's only a two bedroom, two bath. Not big enough. <sighs> that says zero bedroom, zero bath. How is this a zero bedroom, zero bath? Try level modern home. Decoration minimal. There's plenty of yard space left to expand. Do with it what you will. Ooh, I like that. There's only one bed here, which means it's going to be a two bedroom. Yeah, exactly. So it's too small. We have too big of a house, guys, and we are too poor. People are forgetting to add how big of a house it is, so it's really annoying. Um, this one is a one bedroom. Yeah, it's like a lofty bedroom, so that's annoying. Okay, this one looks nice, though. I could go for this one. <laughs> Alright. It's built right where we live, too, because I know that house. So I know this is right next to that. So that's kind of cool. Um, there's no bedrooms there. There's one bedroom, two bedrooms, two bathrooms. Hmm... I guess that one did have it in the description, didn't it? 
All right. Um, zero bedroom, zero bath. I'm a little bit confused. And how can you even see this, like, with a tree in the way? I don't even understand. Um, if any of these are you guys, let me know. Because these are some of these are really good. One bedroom and bath. Where do you even sleep? Seriously. <laughs> a maze house. Oh, my goodness. That is just ridiculous. An Asian heaven. This is one bedroom, one bath. Small modern. One bedroom, one bath. Okay. The pebble burrow. That is just really weird looking. And it's one bedroom, one bath. Okay. And then it is, again, it's by Rachie Bob. I've heard that name before. I just don't know who it is. Okay. Well, we're not getting any of these houses. We're too poor. So... We're going back into live mode. We're going to live in this danky house that we have going on here now. So, unfortunately, we cannot really afford anything for the price range that we could fit into. So, that is definitely unfortunate. Definitely, if you guys want to build a house, please make it at least a three-bedroom. One with, like, three beds for boys. Um, and then do like two like master rooms with like the living areas obviously it doesn't matter the price just do it how you want we can always work up money that's not a problem it may take us a little while but we can always get there all right so he just got two common upgrade parts from that he can go ahead and scavenge for parts out of that all right, what does she need to do? She needs to reach level two of the programming skills. So let's let her do that. Because she hasn't really been working on her job at all. And he just found one electronic Nopsa. upgrade part. Nopsa, all right, so can we... All right, admire your new possession, whatever. Um, you can't really do electronics yet, I don't think. But you could upgrade the refrigerator to reinforce door. One way to make the fridge break less often. So let's go ahead and do that. How many upgrade parts does he have? Ooh, he's got some new things in his inventory, actually. So we need to go through those. And he's got 27. What is this? Electronic upgrade part. Okay. And he's got a new gem in his inventory, I do believe. Let's go ahead and see if we can put this in here. It is the Fozone. Is this it? Yeah. So we got to get rid of this one. So this is worth... 80 simoleons. That's really nice in our pocket. Um, we've got some kitchen upgrade parts. 27 common. Uh, we've got the four plumbing. I still got to figure out how to do this. But other than that, I think we're pretty good. Ooh, he's got um, some plants that I don't think that we have planted. So let's go out here and see what we've got planted quickly. We have got planted. Let's see. We've got mushrooms. This is onions. This is potatoes. Strawberries. Um, we've got the snapdragon flower. We've got the bluebell flower. And we've got an apple tree. So let's plant this. Which is the chrysanthemum. And we don't have it yet. So it would be perfect to do it right now. So go ahead and plant that. Actually, let's not have you plant it. Let's have Tia plant it. Tia, go ahead and plant this. And it looks like our little man came home. So, how did he do? Did he get a skill? Uh, motor skill, no. So, he's 57% complete, though. Can you go ahead and clean this up for me? That'd be great. Okay. All right, and Dad, you need to go to the bathroom. So pee like a champion, and then go ahead and take a brisk shower. And then if you have time, go ahead and upgrade these some more. Go ahead and add self-cleaning. No more cleaning the toilet. Alex will have to um, Alex will have to use the three common and the two plumbing. And then he can probably go ahead and just upgrade this as well. And do, ooh, self-cleaning, water flow, or pulsating massage jets. Much like a car wash, spraying water from more directions will clean Sims faster. Definitely do that, because we definitely need a faster shower. And she's up to programming level two now. 
so she can go ahead and stop because it's all we needed her to do. Now she is ready for her promotion. I bet you this baby is hungry. So I am going to get her to come over here and take care of him and feed him. Go ahead and feed him by breastfeeding. You can go ahead and bounce him. You can go ahead and coo at him. And cuddle. Make a silly face. Go ahead and rock him. And then when you're done with that, I'll let you talk with him as well. Go ahead and talk. Okay, so it looks like you took care of that for me, which is great. Great. I am going to let you draw shapes again. And Dad, you're taking your shower. I'm going to get you to take care of your son over here because he needs to be taken care of, I'm sure. Bottle feed. Go ahead and bounce. You can coo at. Ooh, Marcus and Tia are good friends. You can cuddle. You can make a silly face. Okay, we're waiting for him to upgrade the toilet. Upgrade thy toilet, sir. Alright, forget about the shower for right now. We'll do it in just a second. So make a silly face and then rock. Okay, so she is taking care of him, which is good. They're actually becoming pretty good friends, so that's good. Um, let's see. What does she need for this? She needs to make large orders of grilled cheese. Are there still grilled cheese in here? Open this up. There is some eggs and toast from Tia this morning. There is some more spaghetti. And there is some more grilled cheese still. So before we make any more grilled cheese, we're going to eat the other first. So right now, I don't really think we need to do anything. Um... I'm going to let you harvest all, I'm going to let you water all, and that should be good. Alright, Alex, friend, this is taking way too long. Oh, look how disgusting that is. Disgusting. Okay, um, can you move some out? Absolutely, we can move to another house if we could find one that we could fit in and afford. Do you guys want to look into that? Like moving to another house here in town or what do you guys want to do? Because it's really up to you guys. I was just trying to let you guys kind of help out a little bit. But, I mean, it's okay if you guys don't want to build something. That's fine, too. All right, so this, put it in your inventory. You need to use the bathroom really bad, friend. Let's get you in here and get you to use this pate. <laughs> That's what it sounded like when I said that. Okay, and I'm going to let you just play with your dolls when you're done. That'll be good. Alright, Alex completed that. He installed, he finished installing the toilet upgrade. And Julia brought home 344 simoleons today. She is in a good mood, so I'm excited about that. She definitely, I think, lost some weight at the gym today, too. So that's exciting. And she needs to reach level four of mixology. So I'm going to let her make a special drink. Make the Cupid juice. Mmm, Cupid juice. All right. So you're at a level C still. <laughs> we are moving. We're trying. We're working hard. I promise. It's just not as easy as it looks. I promise you that one. You're missing your family when you're taking care of him right now. Cuddle. Uh, make a silly face. Rock him. And talk to him. And you are tired and hungry. So I am going to let you go ahead and... I am going to let you... Make a special recipe. Oh, okay. Um, open this up. And you can grab the grilled cheese out and eat it. And then you can sleep. So there you go. You've got your night planned out for you until bed. Ooh, that kind of looks really good, doesn't it, guys? Go and drink that up. What is on the top of it? Oh, an umbrella. Oh. Ooh, whoa. <laughs> All right, so Dakota has been promoted to mixologist. 
Um, he will now make an additional nine simoleons per hour for a grand total of 35 simoleons per hour. He has also received the following bonus of 515 simoleons, the Umber Kitchen Sink, which I think we already have so we can sell it. And his next shift is Sunday at 6 p.m. Um, he will be working from 6 p.m. to 2 a.m. And he has thir Tuesday through Thursday off. So that's kind of cool. And it seems like he is moving up in the world. So that's exciting. All right. So what does Dakota need or have to do for work? He doesn't really need anything. And for work, he just needs to work on his cooking. So I'm going to let him serve some... Am I going to let him serve something? How close is he to being done with his cooking to level three? <sighs> Not very close. All right. What does he need to do for his lifetime wish? Make 20 drinks. So let's let him make a drink. That'll be, that'll be good. Make up the... Shoot, you don't have any more. Seriously, how close are you to like leveling this up? Buffalo wing tea. In mixology, you are about... 45% done. That is not what I was hoping to hear. <laughs> okay. And then I'm going to jump over to you. You're just playing with your little dolls. You are exhausted. It's late. I am going to send you to bed. Okay. And then you, on the other hand, you're done taking care of the garden, it looks like, which is great. And you are going to serve up some... Serve up some... What was it? That shade of I thought it was grilled cheese. I don't see it there, though. Did he eat the grilled cheese? No, he's not done yet. Yeah, boy, yeah. So I'm just going to let her come in and use the bathroom really quickly. Go ahead and use. All right. So Alex, my friend, you are exhausted, poor guy. But you know what? You're going to be fine because you are going to be getting in bed soon. You just got to eat some dinner first. Okay, did you finish that off? No. Alright, does she need to eat dinner? Probably. So I'm going to let her have some grilled cheese. How many servings are there left? Alright, so there's only one more serving. So Julia, or, yeah, Julia, you can go in and grab a serving of this. And Tia, you can make up some more grilled cheese. I swear it should be here. Yeah, it's right here. Duh. Hello. Wake up, be doos. Okay, so I'm going to let her finish that. And you are tired. I'm going to let you go to bed then. <laughs> you can go to sleep. Ooh, soup? Ah! Julia's going to finish off that grilled cheese so then we can just put the new stuff away. This should get us a little bit closer. Um, can I separate a household? I have no idea. You're playing a big household and wonder if I can separate them. I really don't know. I would Google it. I don't know. That's what I would personally do, but that's just me. <laughs> oh, man. I'm such a Googler. Okay. So, I am going to let you, my friend, why don't you go ahead and put this away? And if you could clean up the plates that are just kind of sitting around right now, that'd be great. And you've got to make one more serving of them grilled cheese and you will have that completed. So that's really exciting. And then she will be done with the lifetime aspiration of the oh. alumni chef. And she'll get 900 uh, satisfaction points. Pause. I want to look at people's satisfaction points. Um, is this how many he has or how many he... It is how many he has, isn't it? How many do you get for completing this? I guess you don't know. I thought that's how much you get, but that's how much he has. Seventeen fifty-five. Holy smoke, it is. All right. Well, let's check and see what we want to get. Do you guys want to get some lifetime aspiration points things? Potion of youth. Drink this to turn back the clock in your Sims current age. No. Uh, marketable. Marketable Sims sell items they've crafted for more simoleons. That would be kind of cool for Alex. Um, free services. All single-use service requests are free. I don't really get it. Okay. Speed reader. Read books faster than your average sims. A night owl. What is that about? 
A night owl is... Uh, night owls build extra skill at night. Morning sim, they build extra skills in the morning. The mentor, once mentors reach level 10 in certain skills... Hold on. People don't know how to stop touching things. You just unplugged my thing and it wasn't charging. It's really low on battery, so please be careful. Um, once they reach level 10 in certain skills, mentor interaction becomes available and they can help other sims improve their skills even more quickly. So that would be really good for Alex if you wanted to mentor, say, Jack and Xander. So that'd be cute. The most efficient diet beverage on the market. Um, the Insta-Large <laughs> make drink this to become a bigger you. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Um, there's a speedy cleaner. Speed cleaners tidy up much faster. The moodlet solver instantly removes all negative moodlets from your sim. Um, the gym rat. Gym rats build fun while exercising and don't lose hygiene. Um, always welcome when s welcome. Always welcome sims will act more at home when at other residences and the hosts won't mind at all um, sleep replacement instantly fills the energy need so we could drink it I guess drink this to temporarily make your sim inspired and then you have happy or focused or flirty or energized or confident or in or instant hygiene or instant fun so do you guys want to spend any of these points or do you want to just keep holding on to them I wonder if he's the one with the most. He's got 1755. Uh, Julia has 2165. Uh, 475 for him. 900 for her. He has 170. And then the babies obviously don't have anything. So Julia's actually got the most. So let's look and see what she could get because he couldn't only get to a certain point. Um, so she could get creative visionary. Creative visionaries have a higher chance of painting and writing masterpieces. She's not really doing that, so it's not really helping her. The entrepreneurial sims are more likely to get promoted in their career, so that would be nice. Uh, frugal, frugal sims households has reduced bills. Um, independent sims social needs decay slower, so that would be cool too. Observant sims learn the traits of others just by meeting them. Ooh, that one would be good as well. Uh, shameless means they will never get embarrassed. Steel bladder. Don't really want to do that one. Um, beguiling sims can put another anyone in a flirty mood with just one look. She can't get these, but I just want to see what they are. Antiseptic sims hygiene needs decays much slower. Ooh, this one would be amazing. Carefree sims will never get tense. Connections. Sims of connections start all careers several levels ahead. She's already into her career, so it's not really going to help us. I really would like to get someone the fertile. Fertile sims have an easier time when trying for a baby and a higher chance of twins and triplets. Great kisser sims have amazing success with kissing and increased charisma with every kiss. Hardly hungry, don't really want to do that. Never weary, don't want to really want to do that. I want them to have like normal lives, but have benefits as well. Professional slackers have no fear of being demoted or fired. Savant ga sims gain all skills much faster. The super green thumbs will find that the plants they garden have amazing vitality. So really, I think we should either save up for fertile or go with, um, was it antiseptic? Yeah, I think we should get people antiseptic where their hygiene need decays much slower or get them the get some and get someone the fertile so it's up to you guys but that's what I'm thinking anyways after all that talking for probably nothing because you guys probably didn't listen to a word I just said <laughs> um we'll just keep continuing all right so it's about nine o'clock just so you guys know if you guys are wondering like how many more hours we're going until 12 45 a.m. So that's when we're stopping. So we got quite a ways to go. Um, fun and energy is what she really needs. I think we're going to worry about energy first and worry about fun later. That's kind of my motto. 
Mamotu. Okay, and their baby is sleeping. Xander's sleeping. He should be aging up soon, I think. Okay, what is she doing? Washing it? Good. When she's done washing, she can go to sleep. And then Dakota is sleeping, and so is Tia, and so is Jack, and so is Xander, but not Marcus. Marcus is just here in the crib, or the bassinet, whatever the heck this thing is. Um, he's just laying here, as happy as can be. Let's see, parent-wise, more than halfway. I don't like when it goes so fast, because they get so angry so quickly. Um, Marcus. Okay, mom's got a pretty good relationship, too. Um, and then I want to do the same thing with these two and their kid. Obviously. Pretty good relationship with mom. And an amazing relationship with dad. So, there we go. Okay. We could have put both of the babies in this room, actually. It's plenty big enough for both. So we could have done that, but we didn't. This is exactly what I mean. Alright, who needed the boost with him? Uh, Dad's got a good one, but I think Mom's got better. Mm, don't really know. Alright, Dad. Let's go ahead and feed the baby. Doesn't matter. Okay. Make a silly face. Rock. Talk. I would like someone to also um, adopt, too. So, I'd like to see how that works in the game and, you know, see if it's any okay. different, really, than... What the floating apple? Uh, see if it's any different than The Sims 3. But, oh. otherwise, I think we're pretty okay with what we've got here. Alright, so Marcus oh. is now good friends with Dakota, so that's good. Because I know he's good friends with his mother, Yo, Tia. So, obviously no, Tia's his mother. We know no, this. I'm just being ridiculous. But, I'm just saying. <laughs> you know what? Just because these guys are boys and this family seems to have a lot of boys, I'm going to switch this up. I'm going to change it to the blue. Just because I'm tired of looking at yellow. And this one's green, so I'm going to leave that one green. It's supposed to be like the actual nursery nursery here, so... There's like yellow, green, blue, and pink, and this baby's blue to the core. Their room is blue, it fits, and I like it. So we're gonna go with it. Oh, All right. And I know he's, but I mean he's not like starving, so I'm not gonna worry about it too much. All right, and today is Sunday. Sunday, oh, Sunday, Sunday. Oh. Um, let's go ahead and get him to grab some breakfast. Eggs and toast is what's on the menu for today. I'm going to let him go ahead and take care of his needs today. Um, probably dad is the next closest one to aging, to aging up, to getting up. Oh, this baby's crying now. I think mom needs to get up this time and take care of him. Go ahead and breastfeed. Uh, bounce. Coo at cuddle, make a silly face, rock, did I say rock? Yeah, what the heck? <laughs> She's focused? A pleasing environment can put a sim in a mood. Okay. Rock and talk. So there we go. And then she does need to use the bathroom really bad, so I'm going to let her do that. Oh, she can't do that. Okay, dad. Not quite as high as mom is. Okay, so you can go ahead and use. Let's see. You against you. Obviously, you're going to be first because you slept in while he took care of the baby. So, makes sense. There we go. Okay. So, mom. Look at how he pees. It's so funny. He, like, really pushes his butt forward. So funny. It's like, mom told me not to miss. And I can't miss now. Then you can sleep when you get up. You can go ahead and take a brisk shower. And then you can go ahead and eat some of the eggs and toast as well. Um, so grab a serving of that. Um, when dad gets up. Yeah, he's going to need to do some things as well. Alright. So I think today we're going to let little man. Um, 
I wish there was like a little playground here in the town that you could actually like go to with them. There isn't. Like you have to go out in the world to do it. All right. Well, I'm going to let him just play some chess for a little while just to get a skill going for him. Um, he's in a really good mood, so I'm not really worried about him at all. Mom is taking care of. Dad, when he gets up, he is going to use and take a brisk, brisk shower. And then he can go ahead and have some eggs and toast for breakfast as well. Eggs and toast for everyone, I told you. Alright. Um, on to you. And then you break something. Didn't You just had to, didn't you? Repair this. Okay, you on the other hand need to eat first. So let's get you to eat some eggs and toast. Grab a serving. And then when you're done eating, you can come and use your bathroom. And then Tia is starving as well. So she's going to have to eat. So open. Um, grab a serving. Alex forgot to take a shower like always. Oh wait, he's going out there to wash his hands. Must be. Oh, my freaking goodness. How many sinks are we going to break in a day? Repair that. Okay, and I don't think it's Xander's birthday because I didn't get the message that it was his birthday, but that really is irritating. Can you actually put these on the refrigerator? Ugh, gosh. Oh. No, you can't. So I'm just wasting my time. What is wrong with her? Her sink is fine. Alex should be done in the shower just about now. Okay, so you just got a couple people still sleeping. Not too bad. It's only 9 o'clock in the morning, too. So it's not like, you know, they're sleeping forever. Okay, let's see. I'm going to check and see if you guys are writing. Ooh, my battery is actually going up for once. Finally. I think I might build them a house. Um, I don't know. We'll see. I built them this house and I don't really like it. Oh, why don't you brighten his day? Alright, he just got his mental skill to level 3. He's now on his way to becoming a true savant. Alright, ask him to play chess with you. <laughs> You guys can both build your skill together. You can be smart little kids together. Let's just get him some social, so that's cool. Alright, so Dad... If people came in here and saw this house and this household, like, what's going on in here, they'd be like, what are these people thinking? Why are they living in such a small house with so many people? And we would laugh and say, because we're poor. <laughs> okay, so she's sleeping, he's sleeping. She's eating. She's just, she's like, I'm over it. I'm over this shiz. Alright, go ahead and clean up all the plates when you're done too, because that'd be great. Alright, and Alex just finished, or he just obtained the following upgrade parts, one common upgrade part, and one plumbing upgrade part. So that's cool. He really... That's not Alex. Can you keep your people straight, please? Thanks. Alright, so repair this one and I will feel much better about the house. Just feeling like it's broken down right now and not really working. Go ahead and scavenge for parts. You got one common upgrade. And then please mop up all the puddles. There's also another pile out here that you need to scavenge through. Okay. Please clean up all the plates, like I said. He just got three common upgrade parts from the pile. Okay, and you could throw it away. That would be great if you could do that. Alright, Jack just reached level social level three. His creative faculties are progressing nicely. Okay, so he's making a friend. So freaking cute. 
What can they do together? Talk about school, make believe, joke about gross food, goof around. Let's see, be friendly. You can ask for typing tips. Okay. It's cute. Doing something you need to do. One common upgrade part and one plumbing upgrade part is what he just got. Okay, can you clean can you throw this away? That'd be great if you could. Why did he just throw that on the ground? So random. Okay. Scavenge for parts. Well, I guess not. She's throwing it out, so whatever. Um I guess you should go ahead and be romantic and flirt with your wife. You need to do the same thing with your wife because you guys are not any better. And you need to blow her a kiss and kiss her and offer her a rose. Go ahead and woohoo, why not? Do it up. Alright. You need to romance, blow her a kiss, um, express your admiration, um, romance, flirt, and let's see, oh, it's not friendly, romance, you guys can go on Woohoo as well. There you guys go. You guys is ma your relationship is maxed, but not your like romance bar. And then you guys need a lot of work. Please tell me they're gonna go to the right bed. Yeah, they are. Okay, good. I was a little bit worried there for a second. Okay, and these guys are going to the right bed, which is great. I was a little bit worried. Alright, so we've got double woohoo happening right now. It's pretty exciting, isn't it? I think it's exciting. Okay, so it seems like the relationships are still very strong. Even if, you know, they're not maxed, they're still really good relationships, which is good. That's what I want to hear. I don't want to see people, like, fall apart because they didn't communicate enough and then I would be a little bit angry. So I'm happy that they're actually doing what they need to do. Alright, I am going to get Julia out here today. Today's her gardening day. I'm going to let her go ahead and harvest all. She can water. She can weed. Hmm... Alright, weed. Her work starts in about an hour, so she's got plenty of time to do this. Who knows? <laughs> Alright. He needs to... I guess I'm just going to let him box for a little bit. I don't know. I don't really have anything else for him to do. And for Dakota, he needs to cook and mix drinks. I'm going to let him mix a drink because it's something he needs to do for his aspiration as well. And we don't want to spend all of our money doing all this, so that's fine. I think I should really get going now. Thanks for hanging out with me. See you later. Okay, so we could do that. Um, I would make more grilled cheese, but I don't really think we need to. <laughs> I am going to let her go over here, and I'm going to let her dig out of this little rock. There we go. And then you, on the other hand, you're playful. Play five games of chess. Go ahead and play. Who is crying? Alright, mom will be right back. Is dad able to come over? No, he's making drinks. <laughs> that sounds so bad. Alright, so go ahead and breastfeed. Go ahead and bounce. Go ahead and coo at. Go ahead and cuddle. Go ahead and make a silly face. You can rock him, and then you can talk with him. 